Ah, the art of the kiss. It's crucial that you, you right there, master the art of the smooch. Yee guys, welcome back. Hope everyone is having an amazing day. And today we are back with a classic OG banger. We're gonna be blasting embarrassing tutorials in the library part number two. But before we get into the video, we gotta give a big time shout out to the sponsor, Raycon. You guys probably couldn't even tell, but I got the Raycon earbuds right here. They're in, they're so small, so easy to use. And these are what we're gonna be using in the video, but we're gonna be forgetting to pair them. And one of the best parts about the Raycon earbuds is that they're just as good as any other premium audio brand, but they start at about half of the price. So you're getting the good deal, the banger sound quality, and overall, I think, personally, they're one of the best looking wireless headphones on the market. I be using them all the time when I'm training, when I'm working out to knock out one hit Rick, and they literally never fall out. Bro, you're you're not knocking me out, bro. I'm, if anything, I'm knocking you out, bro. Well, I'm knocking you out. Did someone say something? I can't hear over the powerful bass of the Raycons. So if you want to check them out, click the top link in the description to get access to Raycons Black Friday and Cyber Monday deals. But right now, we gotta go blast some embarrassing tutorials in the library. People of all ages. In this video, I'm going to teach you how to get rid of it and prevent it. Welcome back to how to fart in public without people knowing. Such a good skill to have, but few people know how. So today, I'm going to show you how to discreetly release your gas without the people around you smelling or hearing. Now before we begin, let's first define constipation. But remember, we're all different, so we have different toilet habits. But generally speaking, constipation is when you go to the toilet less often to empty your bowels, or when you're passing hard, painful stools. You are going to have to spread your cheeks, but not too much. You are going to have to spread it minimally enough to make it comfortable, <laughs> but enough to make it uncomfortable if you know what I'm saying. But some of the most common causes include a lack of fiber, so not eating enough fruits and veg, dehydration, ignoring the urge to go. Actually, I'll leave a full list in the description below for you. Now the good news is that constipation can usually be treated at home with simple lifestyle changes that we're going to talk about next. But if I don't think huh? your headphones are plugged into that. What do you mean? Oh. Yeah. It was out loud? Yeah. No way. These weren't connected? No. So you literally heard all that? Yeah, I heard it from all the way over there. No way. Yo, I, it's for a friend though. Like, I don't have constipation. I'm doing research for a friend. The guest will release and you'll be exposed by the entire world. Hello? Oh, I'm busy. Are you good? Your headphones, the computer is not actually going to the headphones. No, it's not paired? No. Everyone is hearing it. No, no, no. You heard what I was watching? <laughs> My bad. Sorry. Sorry. I just fired it through for real. Welcome back to How to Suck Toes Like a Pro. If you're ready, Get your toes and get your suck on because we begin now. That is what the final product should sound like if you follow all of these steps. For step number one, I'm going to pass you to my partner, Randall. Randall, take it away. Hey, oh, I hear Jimmy, so oh, what we're going to do now, if you guys don't know Jimmy Boy, right your boy's been wrangling feet for about 10 years professionally now. I can spell out, but I'm probably still found. Yeah, check it out. Bring in the big 
toe first, but no, we're not going to suck yet. We're going to make sure the toes are clean, all right, Jimbo? And then we're going to start off with the pinky toe, Jimbo. Okay, so you suck on that toe, give it a nice little uh, respect, and then you work your way up slowly to the big toe. That's where you're going to go with the final product, but that is step number two. I'm going to give it back to you, Jimbo. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Randall. So, uh, so, uh, R Randall, Randall, Randall here. Back at it again, Randall. No, Bill on the scrub. What up? No what up? It's playing out loud. Out loud? Yeah. You like it? It's kind of trash, no lie. It's trash? Yeah, bro. What is that? Bro, what do you mean? That's me, bro. That's you? That's my song, bro. Uh, it's the big toe specialist. So bro. what you're going to do is after you suck on huh. the needle toes, you are... What happened? We're trying to get some stuff done. What happened? <laughs> you know your things ain't, ain't connected. What do you mean? These weren't connected? No. Bro, tell me you didn't hear all that. Bro, how am I supposed to know? It's loud as shit. Yeah, it was loud in my ears. <laughs> These are the Raycons, bro. Just, just These are way louder than AirPods. Sorry, boys. I won't suck your toes. Alright, everybody. Thanks for tuning in to Solving Your Problems 101 with your host, Big Boy Bussington. Today, we're going to be explaining how to tell your parents that you were the one that pooped in the litter box, not your cat. <laughs> ah, the art of the kiss. Giving that sexy senorita one hot, passionate kiss will leave her begging for more. On the contrary, give her a pad kiss. When, I'm, I'm, after this, after this. So it's crucial that you you right there, master the art of the smooch. Your parents are like, yo, what's that in the litter box that's way bigger than your cat Tuffy's little turd? That thing is about a foot long, and the girth on that thing okay. is massive. We're talking girthy, Johnson. Huh? Okay. It's not, it's not connected. What do you mean? Your headphones aren't connected to your laptop. No way. <laughs> you're lying, you're lying. Oh my, please don't tell me you heard what it was talking about. Everyone has done it before though, right? Everyone's pooped in their cat's litter box, right? Or no? Oh, I didn't even hear that. Have you not? Have you ever pooped in your cat's litter box or no? Oh, I don't have a cat. See, if you had a cat, you'd understand. Rule number two, this is so important, because if you mess this rule up, guys, the whole kiss is done, you've lost it. You want to kiss her right, turn your head right. I've got my lovely. Um, it's not. What? I, I just have to learn how to kiss. Okay. I haven't had my first kiss. Um, not you guys? No. Okay. I'll take out. Thanks so much for watching, guys. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to smash the like button and comment down below what other library pranks you want to see us do. And stay tuned for next week because we got a big merch sale happening for Black Friday and Cyber Monday. In case you didn't know, we just dropped some new merch. We got hats, we got hoodies, we got shirts, and the only place to get it is ibpmerch.com. Repeat, we do not sell on Amazon or anywhere else, so if you get it from anywhere else, it's fake. And also, we're going to be having a special sale for Black Friday if you type in code Winners only when you're checking out next week, you get a free t-shirt with the purchase of any two items. So if you buy a hoodie, a shirt, you get a free shirt. If you buy a hat, hoodie, you get a free shirt. If you buy a hoodie, hoodie, free shirt. So if you wanna get IBP merch, Black Friday is the time, guys. Code winners only, get ready. We absolutely love you guys. And until next time, yee yee. Hall of Fame on them, go damn on them. Take shots in the main minute. Close doors, but I came on it. Yo, why is Ricky in my room making all these weird sounds? Not the cat. Okay, here we go. So today it's gonna be a simple task. You're gonna have to tell him to break down the poop. The heck are you doing? What are you doing? Bro, what? What are you doing? What, what do you is mean? this? What no, is no, this? No, no, go play it. Bro. Today, no, we're no. going to be explaining it's not what it looks to like. tell your parents that you were the one that pooped in the litter box, not your cat. So this is a problem. What are you doing, bro? We don't even have a cat.
Oh. It's not what it looks like, okay? Young boy got it right now, cause I never took a nap or a break in a bag.